okay you guys I am back so as you can see I am doing my nails I ordered the model ones poly gel kit it comes with a soft pink a color changing pink pure white and light apricot it also has slip slip solution a nail file and top coat base coat And it comes with the brush to actually put the poly gel in the dual forms. And it comes with dual forms. I have actually already pre-picked my dual forms. So I am pretty much ready to go. So I've already used this kit once and I used a light apricot, but I didn't record that one. I couldn't get it to record good. So I went ahead and recorded me doing it this time. Um, I'm only showing my left hand um, because the camera ran out. Well, it didn't run out it stopped recording and I didn't realize it um, so I didn't get to show putting on the top kind of stuff but you guys will see that later on so I'm gonna hush up and let you guys watch how I do my nails So all I'm going to do here is just put on the base coat, then I'm going to cure it in my lamp for 60 seconds before I put the poly gel on. This is important because this is what helps the poly gel stick to your actual nail. So all I'm doing right now is putting the poly gel in the dual form and I'm going to take the slip solution and pat the gel into place. Um, this video is sped up a little bit. Um, like I said, it took me 45 minutes just to do one hand and that's because I wanted to cure and make sure everything's right, but you'll see that. But basically all I'm doing is just patting the poly gel into the dual form, taking off any excess or anything, and just making sure it's as smooth and as flat as possible so when it's time to put it on my finger and cure, it will be okay. Okay, so now I'm just putting the dual form on my finger, just pressing it lightly in the middle, and then I'm just gonna remove any excess poly gel from around my cuticle. And then once I have it patted down and made sure you know everything's right, I put it in my lamp to cure on the low setting. Um, I put it in there for 60 seconds. Make sure it's on the low setting. If not, it will burn. And then when you're done, it just pops off. And you have a whole full nail, you guys. I love poly gel, I'm addicted now that I have my kid and I'm, this is my second set that I did. I can't wait for you guys to see at the end.
Okay, so for my ring finger, I did the color change, color changing poly gel. So right now I'm just putting an extremely thin layer of poly gel onto the dual form and just patting it to place how I like it. Once I have it in place how I want it, I take my glitter and I just kind of open it and then kind of dump it in there um, and then, you know, shake out any excess once I get everything on there that I like and then just pat that in so it kind of falls into the poly gel it kind of you know gets off in there and then once i get that done i'll put some more poly gel on top um, to cover it and then repeat the process all over again so you guys this is so easy i know it looks easy now the end result i'm not a professional so they don't look professional but they look extremely well for me not being a nail tech doing my own nails So basically what you see me doing is using my e-file to smooth out under the bottom and then I'm going to go ahead and do my filing and y'all I do apologize I didn't realize that I didn't record anything after this so after I get them cut down shape and file then I put on the top coat and I put them in my lamp for 60 seconds and voila beautiful poly gel nails until next time guys